Hi guys, my name is Adam Hewitt. I am the general manager here at the Peak Performance Project, also known as P3. Uh, we're an applied sports science facility dedicated to building better athletes. With each athlete, we, we basically apply a lot of technology to understanding their movement, um, try to learn about the athlete and understand how their body works and then build really specific and tailored programs to uh, help them prevent injuries and improve performance in whatever their sport may be. The force plate, um, these are customized force plates. We'll look at you know mus muscle activation patterns or how much force an athlete's getting out of their hips compared to their knees, compared to their ankles. Because um, there's usually there's an ideal range for all of these things. Our hydraulic platforms, which we use for both uh, doing different plyometric exercises, um, as well as you can do some overhead lifts. Kaiser machines, basically it's gonna quantify power output in watts anytime you do a rotational movement, a pulling movement. So with NBA players, hip rotation is very important, so we oftentimes use it to train hip rotation in our athletes. Our impulse boxes, these were custom made by us as well. Speed and agility, quickness work, tempo work. Down here we have our incline track. We use it for uphill accelerations to work on uh, efficiency and running mechanics. Up here we'll do a lot of video. Uh, video analysis of our athletes as they're doing agil different agility movements, Go! different accelerations. <laughs> the Utah Jazz, uh, we have a great collaboration with their medical staff and their strength coaches and their coaches. We'll evaluate them, uh, create needs analysis, and then kind of um, talk with the coaches and strength coaches about what they see, what they think they need on the court. <laughs> Al Jefferson increases vertical by four and a half inches last year. Do the, the slide agility test the guys electronically timed, and he uh, he shaved a second off of that. Derek Favors is a guy that uh, is extremely powerful. I mean, he touches 12 feet three inches in here, something like that. Paul Millsap's a guy we've seen increase his second jump by a, a huge amount, and that definitely translates to on the court how much how many rebounds he's getting. I mean, it's, it's a huge component. I can show you Gordon Hayward's graph too. He's uh, he's he's definitely increased his ability to utilize the stretch shortening cycle, which means he. Uh, He's more efficient when going from a small movement to a big movement, when going for a second jump, when changing directions. Make sure I put an ugly face on him. <laughs> Always felt like um, this this was the best possible workout I could get. I feel like you know, uh, I feel like physically I've gotten better the last few years. Uh, I feel like my mechanics are better. Um, I've been healthier, and a lot of that's due to due to P3 here. And I think the Jazz were one of the first teams to really utilize P3. I will be forever grateful for the Jazz to bring for bringing me to Santa Barbara. Each year that Utah Jazz come back and I think we've learned more because throughout the year we're working with other elite athletes and so uh, it's a great collaboration and I hope we continue it going forward.